Hey guys, we're back today with Fish with Attitude. Uh, this week we got a new fish called the uh, geisha or geisha fish. I think in, uh, how they say it in Japan is like geisha. I'm not really sure. I, I looked it up, but I still can't pronounce it in Japanese. But if anyone out there knows Japanese or how to say it, you know, just link me to a video. I'll check it out because I think uh, the pronunciation I looked up was American. <laughs> But anyways, um, this fish is a limited edition fish. It's only available for six days. Uh, last week we got the robot fish and if you uh, looked up the robot fish on the first day or when it was first released, you'll know that it was only available for three days, right? But I think they extended that three days on to uh, for seven days or six days or something like that because I remember saying that I was disappointed in the fish. Well, not in the fish. But I was disappointed in how it was like a three-day event. It was like pretty crazy. But yeah, I mean, this week, this fish is six days and they extended it. If you actually bred the whatever for fish with attitude, the robot fish, if you actually stayed along and bred for the robot fish, you'll know that they actually extended it. So I guess they're kind of listening to uh, their pliers. But anyways, uh, to breed this new fish, you have to use a specific combination. You can't use any other combination. Only this combination works because uh, fish with attitude is very different from other kind of breeding games. If it's like your first time playing, you'll probably get confused with the trait and stuff. But And especially with the limited edition fish because no other combination works. Only this combination works. And usually they, they write it in their description and this is what they've done and I've tested and confirmed this. So you just gotta keep breeding until you actually get this fish. I know that fish with attitude breeding can be a bit difficult. Uh, I, I don't know what to say, but like, I guess most of the limited edition fish has been a bit difficult. Um, since they extended the time, that's good. Uh, I would have been very disappointed if they kept the three days uh, for breeding that the last week's robot fish. I would have been very disappointed. I mean, three days. You know, that's difficult. But anyways, uh, back to breeding this uh, geisha geisha fish. Or the geisha fish. Um, you gotta use the pretty fish and the artistic fish. So I've confirmed this, you know, you got... Uh, I confirmed uh, using this combination does work so if you're not getting it or like I guess it can take a while if you're not getting a fish oh uh, I don't it's really up to luck to be honest with you um <laughs> uh, how you breed it doesn't really matter like it like basically it doesn't really matter which side you select to breed the fish and if they're super happy or not uh, but they have to be at least happy, I think. Because if they're unhappy, you can't breed them. So, um, you just gotta keep breeding until you get, like, the fish. The breeding time should be 8 hours, and the hatching time for the egg is about 4 hours. So, it, it's exactly the same as the other limited edition fish, except I really like this design. This design, this fish design, has, it, it has a bit of mermaid world to it in a fish. Yeah, and I think Mermaid World is pretty cool. Fish with Attitude, you know, if they keep up with uh, these designs, it's, it's going to be good. Um, there's a lot of details in this design compared to the other ones. I, I think the robot fish had a lot of detail too. Um, they're just improving on design and everything. So, yeah, just keep on breeding. Good luck breeding. See ya.